Spencer from Kathy Fishing here today. And today we're on the Big Mohawk yet again. Going for some togs, January 29th. From 6 a.m. in the morning. You can hear the diesel behind me. So hopefully we can get some togs today. It's supposed to be calm. Winds are gonna be a little windy. Maybe fake news, but I know. Hopefully we can get some togs. Leaving right now. See if we can get some time. We got that. We got the whole group. We got Brian, Sean. We got Payne, Dustin, Maddie, of course, and Captain. Uh, so let's get some fish. Hey guys, Pedro here from Kepi Fishing. I'm in the wheelhouse of the Big Mohawk with Captain Maddie. Um, and Maddie, tell me a little bit of how you started the cat, uh, charter business. How I started my. Yeah. How I started fishing. Uh, I was a young kid. I grew up in Point Pleasant. I worked on, I didn't work, I fished a lot with my father on a boat called The Ideal. It was a long time ago and um, it was a fishing club and uh, for my grandfather and my father and I grew up doing it ever since uh, that day. So every day I uh, was off to school, I was always fishing or <laughs> doing something else. That's cool, really cool. And uh, tell me a little bit of any any new uh, guys that got a boat, how, how to look for these wrecks and how to fish these wrecks, how to anchor up on these wrecks. Studying, a lot of practice. Yeah? Yeah, a lot of practice anchoring. You know, anchoring's different every day. You know, a lot of people cheat with their spot locks now, but anchoring is a different, uh, it's a different situation. But um, the more practice, the more time you go out there and do it, the better off you're gonna be and be yeah. able to fish. Yeah, so uh, tell me a little bit, some some tips for any new, if you see any new anglers on here doing some black fish fishing, tell them a little tips. How, how do you, how would you teach them and tell them little tips and stuff like that? Well, the first one is for black fishing is to be patient. You know, the crew's very good, so they can they teach them how to do that, but you have to be patient. It's a frustrating fishing. It could be a lot of fun, but it could be frustrating at the same time. So you got to teach patience the number one you thing, mm -hmm. you know. Second of all, you can't, you know, you can't get mad. You can't get mad like if you see a guy next to you catching them and you're not catching them. You just have to keep it cool and just do the best you can. That's all. Yeah. And that's all that we teach you. You know, a lot of people do learn, you know, they come out here and they've done it for the first time and they don't know what, you know, like they just don't catch them. But the more times they come out, the more practice they get, the better they get. They see people, how they fish, how they do it by talking to other people around the boat and how they're doing it. They, uh, it definitely helps them out. It's also a good thing, good thing to move around the boat when you're in one area and if it's not that packed. That's right. Yep. Move around and always, you know, try different stuff. You know, you know, it takes time. Black fishing are, they're, you know, finicky. So yeah, it's either going to be very good or very bad. And, you know, you just do your best you can. Yeah. What's the, like, the basic setup for a budget-friendly setup that you would... I, I like... Uh, I like a set I would say a seven and a half foot rod Co uh, conventional rod good one to start with you know a lot of people like jigging now so you get your spinning rod you can bring that yeah. too but you always have two rods with you make sure you always have a spinning rod and uh make sure you have a conventional rod um you never know because days they don't bite the jig they bite you know the rig and yeah. they say some days they don't bite the rig they bite the jig so you always have to be ready for everything but to start out I always say conventional right you start start simple Start simple, yeah, that's yep. always good. Single and hook, start simple, cut the crab in half. It's, that's the best way to do it. And I've been, I've been going on the boat. I know the crew boat. How would you describe the crew on here to a New England? That's this on crew's the good. Moment? They're big very moment. good. They help out everybody. You know, Peyton, Dustin, Jack. They all do a good job. Um, if you ever need anything, they're always there to help you. Like Peyton's up there right now, looking around, he's trying to help somebody out. And they just caught a fish up there, starting to get some bites. But he's there, he's always there helping break people out of bottom, retiring rigs. These guys are all good. Yeah. Uh, Dustin, Jack, they're they're very, very good crew. Yeah, and what's like the price for um, here getting on the big mohawk? 105. 105. It's, 100, it's 105. It's an all day trip. So we give you your money's worth. You know, we leave at 6 30, we get back around 3 o'clock, and uh, we try to give you the best day we can. Yeah, so if, uh, if you want to be on the big mohawk, big mohawk dot com right big yep Mo bigmohawk.com uh you can check them out on facebook uh you you also guys do tog fluke stripe tog bass. fluke we fish all year long so just stay to our you know post on our website or facebook or instagram page we always have updates we always have pictures up so check it out yeah all right so thanks thanks for your time all right Maddie. brother go get them yeah get them on the big mohawk <laughs>
All right, get a little talk with Maddie. And again, if you wanna get on a big mohawk, the big mohawk, it's a boat worth the money. You get big fish. You guys, your fluke season was tremendous. Good fluke season, very good fluke season. Even early on in the season, Todd, double digits, right? Yep, double digits. So. So, big one this year is almost 14 pounds. 14 pounds. Yep. So get on the big mohawk and let's go down there and see if we can catch some more talk. Pedro, don't kill me! Don't kill me, Pedro! ounces on that's your fault hey guys you guys get stuck right away just go for the making that right away to put it there you guys make sure you guys keep those sinkers as still as possible don't even move them an inch yes dad not even half an inch <laughs> put a centimeter come on oh, pedro the heavy and the steady oh come on there he is Told me to use a jig. Go on, buddy. Yeah. It's a pole winner. It's a 10-pounder. It's an eel. Pedro, you're the eel. Did he lose one? She caught the whole one. What? Did he lose one? No, yeah. Pedro's got one. Pedro! First drop. No, what are you getting the gap Gaff for? <laughs> what are you getting the gap Gaff for, huh? Gaff it. It's Pedro's on. Pedro's on. What are you getting the gap for, huh? Oh, <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, hey. Dustin, right behind me. <laughs> a little bit of line out for you, Pedro. Huh? Six ounces. An old bottom. I have six ounces. Yes, I do. You're using six ounces? Yeah. Team six ounce. All right. Team six. You know what it is. <laughs> Pedro, I'm going to teach you a little lesson, right? Even if you hold with the six ounces, yeah. I mean, it's a flat sinker. It's definitely going to stay there still. But sometimes it's going to be doing this. Got it. And when it does that, it'll just run away. All right. But what do I know? It's called a fish. <laughs> I'm trying to find bottom. Yeah, yeah, dude. Right. Come on, son. Get him up, Pedro. Go, go. Get him up, get him up. 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 No rush. That's good fish. Good fish, yeah. Come on, Pedro, buddy. The noodle ride, but it's good fish. That was great. Oh, you just got me up there. You just picked me up. That's why it got heavier. That was good fish. I can feel bouncy. There we go. Oh yeah, baby! Yeah! Woo! Look at this kid go! Let's go, double headers! Double headers! Two at a time! Woohoohoo! Dude, that fish, that, that was a fish that Shimi had up there. He just got stuck or something. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, he was on there. I think Carl, it was on Yeah, let's go. Let's oh go. God, that was close too. This one. Oh. Kids got the stuff. Oh. 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 Let's see you. Oh. Damn. Oh. All right, Pedro, we're getting a nice oh. picture of that. Oh. Yes, sir. All right, so just hold it up just like you did before him. Because I want to get him with the two hooks in there now. Yeah. Just be careful, though, because he'll flop. Frank, come in. Give me the picture. Sponsorship. <laughs> <laughs> you get the tangle in there. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting the tangle, Brian. Yeah, just cut Brian's line. He did already. Yeah. <laughs> He's out, buddy. 
this kid, dude. He's trying to get the sponsorships ready. He already has them. You already has them? You already yeah! What? Who sponsored you? Tsunami from Mini Bay. Like so. <laughs> Say thank you guys for having Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Dustin put the rig on, on yeah. <laughs> I didn't do nothing. This is all you, my friend. <laughs> this one might come in close. That's a good fish. Someone throw one in that ball. That's a giant. It's a big fish. That's a bulldog, man. That's a slob. That's a big fish, man. Get your picture. Here, let's get your picture. Here, get that one. Crazy that one, crazy. Oh, there you go. Right, right, Captain Salvo. It's the third line, right? Yeah. Short. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Two lines. Memorial, then we get a chance, Pedro, right? See ya. Alright. Oh, there he is again. Oh. Can't stop Got him. him. The man's on fire. Oh, come on. Yeah, that water whip. I was hoping we got that Maddie video when we got that fish. I know. I'd just be so curious to see well, how they I, I really turned on just to go find that video. I yeah. Like, I I don't, of all the black fish underwater videos I've ever seen, I don't think I've ever seen a 10 pounder. I don't know if they've ever, they've ever had one like No, there the has been. There's the one guy who got some as Sitting sleeping. on it. As you're sleeping? As you're sleeping. He like yeah. goes up to him. Oh, big one. Big one. Oh, it's scuba diving. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Hey, uh, this one I might need in that. Well, it's fighting good. Nah, boat flip's only for you today. <laughs> Unless it's over six. <laughs> All right, sure. Switching spots. <laughs> you drove me. I'm surprised you haven't kicked him out already. All right, Pedro, if this isn't a keeper, you got the walk of shame. Ten minutes. <laughs> Ten minutes in the ice box? I think this is a good one, actually. This one sat on it. Yeah, it's swallow. That's that's a real one. An eel. Could be an eel. I don't want an eel. Yeah, okay, big mud marlin. <laughs> Yeah, this one. Pedro! Baby keeper. That's definitely a keeper. <sighs> nah. John, that's a keeper. Oh, yeah. That's a keeper. Whatever structure we have, it's tall. I ain't got shit. It's just tall. Yeah, I think it's, it's more over that way. It's, it's, like, it's like a wall. Yeah. Look at this kid go. Nice job, buddy. Thank you. Oh, another one. Showing everyone how it's done. Picture of this one, Dustin? Sure. Just want that for you. Oh. Okay. Thank you guys for bringing him with you. Okay, that one costs a lot. Come on, right next to him. Come on, turn off the second page of my things don't worry. Holy crap. I'm glad you were bringing food to the house, son. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, I'll go make you love him. Look at this. <laughs> Only put a little bit on so these I bet these guides get stuck in everything. Right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Guys are 
going to be a mate's nightmare. <laughs> Which one? Who? The new guys. Oh, yeah, yeah. They're going to buy double. You need a uni. Oh, I know. This is your guy's nightmare. You got that hot tire. Not, sir. Nope. <laughs> Time to get a lemon today, baby. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Are you on my spot? <laughs> no, you yeah. can go your father for that. <laughs> of course he's in my spot, yeah. He's a young senior ranker. Drop a little bit out. Like that? Perfect. Alright, goodbye. <laughs> yeah, you gotta move, you know? It's only one at a time. You gotta rotate over. <laughs> Well, that that there. fish was sitting on it too. You saw it? Yeah, because you had two bites and then you put it back down there and it was just there. It was there. I'm loving this rod. And Sean's on. I saw that. Yeah, I put the, the mid, the medium to smaller ones, cold ones, took the legs off, and I can share that a little bit there. The weight? Pedro, you, you limit out today? If you limit out today, I'll take you to the store. Myself, and you can buy whatever we want. He's already got two, I think. I don't know. Oh my god! Oh, what I oh, get from my mom. That's a fish. Real, brother, real. Pedro, uh -uh. real. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Pedro, do you buy these fish at the market? No. Is that a fish or a bottle? No, it's a fish. Just not a big one. Thank God. Whacked it. Still on there? Damn it. It sucked. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. There's something on here. A rock or something. Probably got me. It's weird because there ain't no rocks here. There's something on there. <laughs> There's something additional to my crab on this line. I caught the bite. A piece of line with another sinker? Potentially. <laughs> Who is it? The last lady a couple weeks ago? Anchor? Yeah, no, you see that just, picture? You're probably bringing me up. Am I getting you? I got a bunch of shit reel with them. I got a fish? Like I said. That, that ain't a fish. fish. Huh? Ooh. That ain't no fish. Jeez. Long way up, huh? <laughs> now that was it. I thought you had to... Hey, you were good at that. Oh. Hey, something was up. Yeah, it popped me out of the rug. No, no, I'm gonna try jumping. I'm gonna try jumping right down. Oh, it's a good one. Very cool. Flying like crazy. It's a fight ball! Yay! We work with this one there, Pedro. Good one. Did I send you the yeah. thing with the this the school bonfire? What? Oh, oh, the kid wanted to go uh, throw the, the fire in. Yeah. And it blew up on him. Oh my Wait, lord. Wait, is that the guy that shot the arrow? You missed. Oh, did you see that? I saw that one too. You saw that one. That one's bad. Yeah, that's what alcohol and fire does. Yeah, I'm fighting an arrow on fire. I can't see where I'm shooting. Okay, I'm right close. Here, buddy. A little short. Alright, here we go. Short. A little short. This one down there. Careful. Oh, man. Crab fight. 
So I'm gonna have to try and work them out. It's like a real good. Now lift, 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 lift. Nope, oh, try again. This ledge here is like 15 feet. Oh, yeah. Oh, come this on. This comes like 30 feet off the bottom. Yeah. I think he's off. There's a bicycle down there, too. Oh, I caught it through a bag. The Schwinn? It's an Electra. The Electra? Was it Jack's? No, no, it's it Jack's. Jack's. Electra, the bike. Oh, an electric, like Jack's new electric bike. Just got pissed off at him, brought it out on the trip, threw it over. So on that fish? I feel him. Yeah, I think he is, but I don't feel it.
believe the amount of small fish on this thing. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. Right, he cuts it short every day. He cuts the fish every time he's bomb, he's not catching the keepers. Taking autographs, you know, at the end of the day, too. Hey, I'll break this one, though. Did you see what he did, though, when he lifted up his jacket? He called out to the scuba diver down there. Listen, I got, I got one in the, in the rock right here. Put a fish on, <laughs> get it out. They just have the cage. Press buttons. Break and run. Ron's tying knots and Doug's putting fish on there. <laughs> Not yet, not yet, not yet. It's just a rod. Is my camera on page? I don't even know. Okay. It's a digging roll night, Ranger. Oh, yeah. Hopefully, it's my. Uh, Oh no, yeah. Where in the goo? You might be good. Hopefully. Touching. Is that Probably touching? That's good. good. Put it in the cooler. Watch his tail, bro. Hey, hey, 
Yeah, stand on his tail and pull his head up. Pedro's got him. He needs to practice. <laughs> Pedro, you need a leader. They're saying they take him some leader. You want, you want, uh, what? Third over, Pedro. Third over. Why don't you just grab it and throw it over, bro? Just throw it over. You see that? What is that? He was holding lined up with me. I looked and I was like, if you jump on me, I'm gonna do the same exact thing. So punch right in the nuts. How's that feel? It's not good. Small one. Oh no 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 no! This kid is something else. Something else. What is this freaking this formula, man? <laughs> Creatine? <laughs> you on that, Kendra? Ah, uh, yeah, just maybe, maybe. You see, he's looking like he might be. Oh, oh, oh. sorry, Pedro. It's all right. Yeah, Just a little bit left for me, Pedro. Ah, yeah. Uh, yeah. You too? No, it's my freaking crab. Oh. Go, buddy. That's one more. Three. Oh, now I'm about to go broke today. That's three. Good job, Pedro. 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 Get a picture down, buddy. Uh, Pedro, let's let some line out first. <laughs> Remember that one I lost at the last trip? Dude. Tight drag. Pull him up, Pedro. <laughs> Oh, Pedro. <laughs> <laughs> more, Pedro. It's more. Yeah. Ready to start kicking your dad? <laughs> Don't talk smack. <laughs> Don't talk smack. What the fish is doing, Pedro? Oh, male too. We'll get a nice picture at the end of that. Yeah. I like to I need that real. 
Ay, ya pueden, please. Something. Number four, fourth keeper. 